uh, donating to certain uh, like charities. We have like AYSO, we donate to for years upon years. Uh, we also donate to cancer research for children. That's something we don't stop. We have to do that all the time. I'll start with the cancer research because my daughter has leukemia, so what we do is I have uh, those little coupons in the store where we donate a dollar. If they, if they pay a dollar, they donate a dollar, and uh, we donate everything we get to, uh, the, it's called the jo jo Joseph Jocks Foundation. And uh, we'll match, actually, whatever donations we get. Last year, we actually raised $7,000. So, we eliminate all paper. So I think by using, utilizing you know, the internet in any way possible, it's probably our best bet as retailers. Yeah, newsletters instead of postcards type of deal. Perfect. Yeah, we do. We work for the Boys and Girls Club. Yes, we do. So we do a lot of charity and donations. So. Recycling. We're using a lot of uh, American products, a lot of hemp, a lot of natural fibers. But die, things like that. The, uh, the bag, when we give out to consumers, we use a recycle bag. Uh, we're trying to think of ways to get into better people's values. How? How are we doing that? We're doing it through doing some workshops in the afternoons at our stores. On behaviors and attitudes and values and we are in a little bit of town 1500 people we have one street light and so for convenience we have bottled water and sodas and and teas tech you know local Texas teas which is also being responsible because it doesn't have to be shipped you know a million miles away so we try to buy local and we tell people if you finish your drink in our area leave it outside by our door and we will take it to recycling. And I think they feel better knowing that it's going to be recycled. I think it makes a big difference. 